Slippers for Birds An interesting story. The slippers were sitting by the fire with the boots nearby. The boots were dirty and wet but the slippers were cozy and clean. Where have you been? said the slippers to the boots. Out in the rain. We'd like to do that, said the slippers. It's dull being indoors all day. Yes, it would be, answered the boots. Then take us out with you, for we can run and jump and walk fast, too. Look, and the slippers ran across the floor. So away they went together, through the cat flap in the door. The boots had to crouch low to get through but the slippers slipped under it easily. Out onto the pavement they went. Where shall we go? asked the right slipper. To the park, decided the right boot. The grass was wet there and soon the slippers were soaking and the fur inside damp and dirty. Let's wash ourselves clean again, suggested the right slipper, we are very dirty. They leaned close to the pond and splashed and splashed each other. Soon they were dirtier and wetter than before. They couldn't go home like that. While they were wondering what to do, an owl flew down from the tree above them and said, Better not stay here for the snow might come and bury you. Climb up the tree. The boots decided to go home, but the slippers did as they were told and when the snow fell that night they were cold but quite safe. They stayed there until the spring came and they watched the father and mother birds flying round searching for a suitable place to make a nest. While they were searching the birds saw the slippers and said, those beautiful slippers would make lovely nests for our babies. And so they did. Well, said the right slipper, this is a change from being full of feet. Yes, agreed the left slipper, and soon we shall be full of eggs, and after that, full of baby birds. So they became two happy nests full of chirruping baby birds.